client relationships are built through touch points, like a friendly email or a detailed contract. If you're building relationships with multiple clients at once or the same type of client again and again, you can create a template for each touch point so that you don't have to start from scratch with each person. In this lesson, we'll provide the kinds of form templates you can create in Dubsado. There are five types of form templates and they all function a little differently. So be sure to pick the right type of form when you're getting started. Contracts outline the terms and conditions that the client needs to agree to and provide a space for your client to sign the document electronically. Subagreements also allow for electronic signatures. This type of document is used for something like a photo release, waiver, or design proof, or anything that you want your client to sign in addition to your normal terms and conditions. Questionnaires collect information from the client, most commonly asking about their preferences, background information, or feedback. Proposals help you pitch your products and services to a client. Whether you offer packages or create completely custom quotes, proposals make it easy for clients to book with you when they're ready. The proposal is different from all other form types because it automatically creates an invoice as soon as it's been applied to a project. We'll cover proposals more in depth in Unit 5, Getting Paid. The first four form types are sent to your lead or client through a Dubsado project. When you're ready to send a form, you'll make a copy of the master template inside of a specific client's project. If needed, you can edit or adjust the copy before sending it out to the client. This allows you to quickly personalize your communication to one specific person without impacting the master template. The last form type is not sent through a Dubsado project. In fact, it's the exact opposite. A lead capture form is a contact form for a potential client or lead to fill out. Once completed, a lead capture form actually creates a new project for that lead and can even apply a workflow template within that new project automatically if you set it up that way. You can embed this form on your website or send it as a public link through social media. The lead capture form is often your first point of contact with a new lead, where everything starts in their journey of working with you. We will cover lead capture forms more in depth in lesson three of this unit. Here's a tip. We have a template library in the form section. If you see something you want to use, simply add it to your account and customize as needed.